Hello, my dears. Happy Monday to you. Welcome to a brand new week on my channel and welcome to a new build. We are up in the cliffside of Strangerville. We're going to be building a gorgeous kind of gothic carpenter house for a beautiful family. This is going to be called the Espinosa residence, by the way. Um, I'm going to be making the family and probably showing them to you tomorrow or maybe the next day. I'm unsure, but they're going to be here. They have Mexican descent. We're going to use a lot of the new beautiful objects that came with the last update. Um, cannot wait to do that. And I would like some of your guys' help. You guys from Mexico or even just in South America in general, you Latin beautiful bloody people. Help me out with this because I am not, you, you're going to educate me now. I am not well versed on your culture. I appreciate your culture thoroughly. I love seeing it. It's beautiful. It's colourful. Um, but I need help with this. I need help with you. What What's in your family's houses? What do you normally do for like, kind of like layouts, floor layouts um, in your houses and stuff? Like, I would love to know. You're going to educate me on this and help me out with this family that I'm going to be making. I'll make sure to check the comments and kind of pull up a few ideas. And I'm also going to be trying to kind of delve into other cultures up in this area as well. So I really want to do a Native American family. So if there's any of you beautiful Native American people out there, um, help me out as well. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of not well versed on your culture, but I find your culture absolutely beautiful and fascinating. I love your outlook on life and the world and nature. Um, but I would still love some of your guys' help with that as well. Um, I'm trying to be as inclusive as I possibly can with everything. I've had a few comments recently were like, how, how come you haven't done this kind of person? Or how come you haven't done that kind of family? It's hard to generalize everything for everybody. I'm trying my best. I'm trying probably a lot harder than some other simmers out there. <laughs> um, but it's only, it's only me. I'm one person. I come from a culture that I know thoroughly well. I'm kind of okay with other cultures, like being well-versed on them and stuff and understanding. But I need your guys' help with that. Um, so I don't really want to get called out for not being inclusive because I'm trying my darn hardest to be inclusive. And I think the majority of you people out there know that is me. I want everyone to feel included, especially in this kind of series. I mean, don't forget, we've still got other worlds to do yet. Like, it's going to be a whole lot. But just remember, I'm trying to be as inclusive as I possibly can. And I want everyone to feel kind of represented in my Let's Build series. Uh, but yeah, I want to hear from you guys. I want to hear from you guys with the Espinosa family. I really want the mum to be the kind of matriarch of the family, the main breadwinner as well. I want her to have a really kind of high powered job. This is going to be a lovely house, four to five bedroom house, I would say, maybe four. Um, I really want the grandparents or one of the grandparents to live here as well. And I want two teens. I don't want any children in this household. I just want it to be two teens. So it's like a household of like mum, dad, grandparent, and two. So a household of five, five sims. So a five bedroom house would probably be the best way to go. But, um, I still need your help. Anyway, I've waffled on long enough. Let's flop on over into game and we're going to start building this bad boy. Here we are. So we're on this one here. This is the kind of first lot as you come into this area. I just thought this would have been the perfect place where this house is going to be. So all of the architecture styles up here are all going to be mixes of kind of gothic carpenter houses and um, Queen Anne style Victorian looking houses. Um, and I really want to do, I'm thinking about this lot right over here. I'm doing kind of like a rundown house. Um, and I've got a storyline development with that. I won't, um, I won't spoil it just yet, but I'm very interested about doing that. I really am. Really am. Anyway, here we go. Let's make a start, shall we? So, oh God, that's a bit tall, babe. Bit tall. Bit tall. We're going to stick you on a little medium height, my sweet, because that was a bit excessive. Let's get some better lighting going over here. Oh, that's gorgeous. Yes. <sighs> Right. <laughs> How are you all doing? I hope you've had a good week. Hope you had a good weekend even, sorry. Um, I had a lovely weekend. Lovely, lovely, lovely weekend. It was so nice to get out in nature um, and explore with my family, like with my parents. We went down deep 
down into Cornwall on Sunday. Um, on Dartmoor on Saturday with my best friend. We had big walks. My legs are still aching from these walks. They really, really are. But I had a blast. I had a blast. I'm loving having these weekends for myself. So thank you to everybody that has kind of just let me, not allowed me because I know I'm allowed, but just let me have this kind of free reign to kind of recharge and come back when the week is there. When the week is new and I feel so much better for it. And this is all down to you guys. You guys are just, you're such a great community. You really are. <laughs> you really are. And I'm so happy. I'm so happy at the minute. Um, And it's all down to you, lovely people. It really is. What? What? bloody going aren't we we are bloody going we've got a floor plan going already um so this is obviously going to be the main entrance here need to do like a little wraparound stair moment i think this is going to be quite difficult so i think i might get the stairs in first let's flop some stairs in oh it's on a medium height i need to remember that um just generic stairs for the minute uh like this stunning so we do need quite a hefty a hefty oh i suppose that's okay actually i suppose that will fit in there okay let's have a look i don't think it will just thinking. No, it won't because it needs to be like there. So I might need to pull that back now. Uh, let's just get rid of you for the minute and flop you in that way. Um, We're going to talk about the latest update with The Sims. The update that was supposed to have uh, fixed the skin tones. Or at least was it like a... I don't know what it was supposed to be. Was it supposed to be like a a general fix until they can actually fix the skin tones because that was not a fixed skin tone patch I went into game and I've seen a few other simmers talking about it as well. Um, It was not what I thought it was going to be. I know we've still got a skin tone update that's supposed to be coming out in, what, December, was it? Um, But, oh. <laughs> oh. It was bad, wasn't it, loves? It was, it was bad. It was bad. I thought that we were going to at least get a semi kind of fix for it. I'm just choosing this fence for the minute because I really want to do like an an overlooked balcony edge here, I think. Can I boost this out now or do I still need to do a wall there yet? Oh, no, I can. In fact, I'll probably still need to do the wall there. But, um, but yeah, that wasn't the vibe that I was uh, wanting, really. To be honest with you, won't lie. Um, a little bit crap, to be honest. Little bit crap. What were your guys' thoughts on it? Um, probably the same as mine, I think. <laughs> probably the same as mine. <laughs> yeah, it's not the vibe. Not the vibe, my loves. Um, looking forward to the actual skin tone update. Uh, it would be a good Christmas present for everybody out there wanting to be represented, I would imagine. Um, it just needs to cut. It just needs to be more. We I need to see more. Need to see more from The Sims. I need to see more kind of accountability as well for things that... I'm going to make this a bit deeper because I'm remembering we need five bedrooms. So um, this whole floor plan might change. So let's get an interesting shape going back here. Um, More communication. And not just for communication from the community manager themselves. Like I want to see more communication from... Um, and even I saw Jesse, like Plum Bella talk about this as well. Like more communication from... The Sims themselves, because I never see that. Never ever see that. It's always from a community manager, or it's never from the general manager, Lindsay, or and it, it, it is sometimes when things get brought to the horizons more, you know, when it's more of a serious like thing, they but I I don't know. I'm just confused about the whole situation at the minute. I really am. Really am, and I'm not for it, really not. <laughs> Anyway, let's talk about lighter things, shall we? Let's talk about lighter things. So, this house. <laughs> this house, the Espinosa residence. This would be a cool size bedroom. For single bedroom, for a teen, fine. In fact, I might even just shorten that bathroom down there and have that as a teen bedroom there. Same here as well. So, it might mean that we're going to miss... Yeah, we'll miss a bit of that out there. That's fine. That's a substantial size bedroom for a teen. Um... What are we going to do here? Oh, this could be hallway. That's fine as a hallway. Really is. I could even do like a little granny annex, couldn't I? Like a little separate hut for the gran. I'm feeling a gran as well. I'm feeling a gran coming on. Maybe we can make her kind of resemble that beautiful woman in, um, what was it? Coco, the Disney film. Oh, that scene in that movie. 
And I've only watched it recently as well, that scene in that movie. And I think you, if you've seen it, you will know. I won't spoil it for anybody who hasn't. Oh, that was probably one of the most powerful things I've seen Disney do. Um, that really was beautiful when I saw that. Really, really was beautiful. I'm getting a little bit emotional thinking about it, actually. So I'm not going to talk about it because I will cry. <laughs> I will <laughs> cry. <sighs> I very much will. Um, we're going to carry on. <laughs> Before I stop crying over a Disney film. But it's not just a Disney film. It's, again, representation. And representation is very important to me. It really is. Really, really is. Okay. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> moving on my loves right we're gonna build a ceiling on there as well is that a good floor plan i think it is god that came together quite fast didn't it darlings didn't it just let's get rid of that grid so we can see yes nice big landing big enough for timothy to do some filthy things on a family bath there is only going to be oh we can do another bathroom down here so we'll do a two bed two bathroom um I would maybe be able to get like a smaller little ensuite here. Oh, that's quite, quite tight there, isn't it? Um, hang on. Hmm. Um, like a cheeky ensuite. Maybe if I did that. No, absolutely not, Aiden. Absolutely not, indeed. And I don't like that now. So maybe. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's big enough there. Oh Christ! I took away the wrong wall. Took away the wrong bloody wall, my loves. Okay. Ensuite bathroom to the master bedroom here. So there'll be two bathrooms upstairs. That should be enough for two kids. Um, so the, the, nan, the grand could stay in here, but I love the idea of having a little annex at the back. Maybe the nan is like really into nature and culture. Yeah, we're going to do that. Right. And then up here, I'm going to go up one higher up here. Do I want to keep it at that height? I think so for the minute. I do think so. Um, I need a little think. I've had a little think. I had an aggressive vape. Very aggressive vape. And I'm ready to crack on. I'm ready to crack on with this. Right. First things first. I'm going to get the roof sorted on the actual kind of turrety looking area itself. So I'm going to pull you down. I'm going to take you to about there, my love. I'm going to pull your flaps out. Don't, don't get, don't get all, don't get all squiffy. I'm just going to pull your flaps out. Um, uh, if you're new here, we like flaps. We like saying the word flaps here. It's just one of our kinks, isn't it? Isn't it, everybody? It's just one of our kinks. Really is. Oh, yeah, that's nice. But I think what I'm going to do is also flop in one of these roof lines here as well. Um... I may keep it at that height for the minute, but that might change just to get a little bit of... Yeah, that's nice. That is nice. And then on here, I think a gabled roof would look great, like, on this part. Let's pull you out here, sweetie. Um, Excuse you. Thank you very much. Um, What kind of job would the uh, mum have? She's going to be... She's got a... She is the main breadwinner. She's the... Not the matriarch as such. Well, she is. She's the matriarch of her own family. Because I'm going to say the gran is on the father's side of the family. So she's kind of the matriarch of that part of the family, I would say. Yes, that's a good idea. I like that. Right. What I'm going to do first is just put this little wall going on there. Just so I can get a good roof line going on this bit here as well. Um, I'm thinking about maybe using a half hip. This might change, but we're going to trial it first and see what happens. Um, can I go to there? I'm not going to use this, by the way. What I wanted to do up here. Hmm. Can I? Oh, God. Didn't mean to do that big jump then. Um, my thoughts were kind of having this quite high. Let's have a look at that. Oh, that's nice, actually. That's nice. Right. And then I can whiffle this around to there like a saw do i want to take that all the way down on that side oh i think i might do i think i might do um just ignore this for the minute oh that's not right is it that's a bit oh that looks a bit weird why did why did that all of a sudden change height did i touch that did i touch that without my knowledge of touching it 
Maybe, but maybe not. Who can say? Right, let's pull you up as well. Oh, I like that. Yeah, okay. Um, What I would probably need to do here is wrap that around to like there. Hopefully I can meet this in the middle quite nicely. I, d I doubt I'm going to be able to. Uh, mm. I don't want to go up any other level. So maybe using um, half hip is probably not the right way to go about this. Because I don't want to go up another level here. <laughs> Let me have a little think. No, it is the right roof to use. It's the right roof, the half gabled. Um, a half hip, sorry, not half gabled. Um... It's just trying to work out this area here now. I've also put another roof out line on this part here, which I think looks really nice. And I've also pulled down the flaps on these parts here as well, just so they like kind of cover the areas going on there. Um, so what I probably need to do here now is maybe mirror this on this side with this exact roof going on. Um, I'm going to pull that right to maybe about there. Yeah, that should be fine. That should be fine. And what I'm going to do is slope the roof. Oh, damn. I forgot about that. Um, I might need to just go up on there. I don't really want to have to go up on there with another like level like here. But I might have to. Oh, I don't like that. That's because of this here. So what I need to do here is bring this back. Oh, not that far, darling. Just to there. Lovely. Then I can pull that across, look, which leaves this in the middle here. Um, oh, that's not too bad. I didn't think I was going to like that. Or do you know what I might do there instead? I might add in just another gabled roof. Okay, so I'm going to do an attic here. Uh, little spooky attic. Oh, damn. Oh, I didn't realise it was that high. I'm not going to move. I like the height of that from the front, so I'm not going to move that, which means I'm going to have to put a flat surface in there um I've, I've i've used a few of these sometimes but i don't this isn't going to work now but um i've used a few of the cats and dogs things to cover up like thing holes in the roof and stuff but i think for this build i think this is going to have a black roof as well um so i think what i'll do here is, can I get it, please? I've, my brain's gone to mush. I think I'm going to add in this object here. Size it up. Oh, look at that. Do you fit? Oh, like a glove. Like an absolute glovey dream. But, um, hang on. Oh, actually, I may even go in there with a half wall. Oh, I think I'm going to. I think what I'm going to do here, let's get, how big are you? Oh, you're a bit tall, darling. Just a bit, oh, that's a bit too, oh no, that's fine. That is absolutely gloriously fine. What I'm going to do there is pop that like that. Mm, yes, I think so. I'm going to then do a trim around the top with the black, maybe. Let's have a look at that. Oh, no, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm going to get rid of you. Hear me out. I'm then going to, hopefully, yes. Okay. This is what I wanted from the front here. Um, Do that there. But I might tuck these flaps in, you know. And this here as well. I'm going to tuck that in. Bring you all the way in there. Yes. I wanted that detail at the front there. So I'm glad that that's apparent. And I will put that flat surface in there. But I think for the minute, I'm just going to leave it like empty until we've kind of picked wallpapers and stuff. But, um, right, I, I also need to, can I like get down to, no, I can't see that. I need this, I need, right, I'm going to have to go in here. Where are you? There you are. I don't need you anymore. I think that was the right one. Yeah, that is the right one. Then it gets rid of that horrible white line that we had creeping through there. Okay, I'm happy with how this shape's turning out. I do want to maybe make this a little bit taller. Yeah, I do. 
I do, my loves. I bloody do. I think we're going to make this a really lovely, colourful build. So maybe like a red and green or... I don't know. Let me go. I'm going to go and get a palette of wallpapers down and sort of see where we're going to go with it. I think the palette for this house that I'm really going to enjoy doing is yellow and red together with a black roof. I think that would really look lovely. And again, trying to keep him with that gothic uh, carpenter vibe by making the house out of wood. I think that's why it's called Carpenter Goth. I could be wrong. I'm Again, I'm not well versed in it. I'm learning myself. So feel free to correct me. But I'm sure Carpenter Goth is like kind of like wooden Victorian goth architecture. Could be wrong. Could be wrong. But you know, it's all about learning, isn't it, darlings? All about learning. And I am learning on the job. Same thing with my whole YouTube career. <laughs> I'm learning on the job, sweeties. Right. Do I want to do a black trim or do I want to do a white trim to help tie in some of these bits, which would probably be a bit better, actually, if I did a white trim and a black roof. We're going to use this roof trim as well. Is this the roof trim that's on it already? Well, we're going to use that one then, darlings. Absolutely. And let's get the roof tile chosen first. Do you want to pick? Oh. Oh. Oh, the only problem is, is this line here looks really weird. But maybe if I... Oh, Christ. Christ on an absolute bike. Maybe if I just like... No, I can't do that. Uh, I wish they would line up. But with this roof line, I don't think we're going to be able to make them line up very well. Just had to check I was recording then because I thought I wasn't. Um, but yes, I think this might be the right tile to use for this house. Oh, I like it. Yeah, I think the white trim as well. I do think the white trim would look really nice. Okay, door. Front door's going to be there, obviously. Um, do I want to do this window above this door here? Do I? Or are we going to be putting these windows here? Or do I want to do a full window moment there? See, there's so many choices, darlings. So many bloody choices. It really is. What about that big... What about this one? Can we do that? Can we put you there? Let's have a look. Uh, I mean, no. I could put them there. Oh, is that creeping into that? Oh, look, it's cutting off two bloody rooms there, isn't it? Oh, let me flop that open. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, I don't mind that. I don't actually mind that, my loves. I could do that, you know. And then do like a little, maybe a four moment down here or three moment down here. Don't really like that. <laughs> don't really like that at all. I am going to be putting a roof line here as well. I forgot about that. So let's do that first before I put the windows in because um, I think it might change the look of it by putting this wind, this uh, roof shape that I want to do here. Um, we're going to tuck that flap in for a start. We're going to pull you right to the edge there and tuck that flap in because you will be poking through into there because Sims. Um, all the way to there. Can I do that to there and maybe all the way across? To there and tuck that flap in. Let me have a little look at this. Oh, I like that. I do like that. I think it does need to be a little bit steeper though there. Like that. Yeah, that's not. I don't like that window now. See? As soon as I put the roof in, it changes that window for me. Yeah, that's not the vibe we're going for, my darlings. Not the vibe. I think it's going to be a double window there. Three down there looks nice. Yeah, I don't mind that. And I do maybe want to put these on these. On the M. Um, I could put these on the top here. Do I want to do one there? Oh, yeah, that looks nice. I can't do one on the other side. No, no. Yeah, I don't I don't hate that. I wish these came in all red. I like the white, but I wish they came in all red. I really do. What's the yellow look like? Eh, I don't want it to blend in too much. That's not too bad. Can I do that there then? Mm, no, that looks like um, McMansion. We don't want McMansion vibes here. This is not the place. So I may just use these all the way along. Um, 
Is that too high? I don't want the windows to be too high on the inside. Let me just get down into this view. It's not that bad, actually, but I prefer them at that height, I think. I do prefer them at that height. So I think we do need to pull them down slightly. Same here. Same with you as well, loves. Down you come. Stunning, stunning, stunning. Oh, no, I don't like that. <laughs> don't like that. <laughs> no. No. We're going to keep them at that vibe. They may be a little bit slightly higher on the inside, but, you know, je ne sais quoi, to be honest. Or I can try these down here as well. Um, by the way, I'm indecisive today. I don't know if you've noticed, but we're just going to have to ride with it, loves, because it's the vibe of today. It really is. Right, that's not at the right height for a start, darling. Where's the top? I need to get these bloody floors down so I can see what I'm doing here. Right, so that's to there. Let's have a look at that. Oh, I like those windows there. So maybe we'll keep on the actual turret a bit. We'll keep these windows here. Let me see that. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like it down the bottom. I don't mind it above, but I don't like it down the bottom. Let me have a little think, because I think I'm losing my way slightly. I think I found the windows that I want to use for this. Um, I ended up going for these ones. They're from Strangerville as well. I got rid of the pointy ones. They just weren't fitting with the vibe with this house. Um, so I ended up using these instead. And I much prefer them. I think they're really cute. Again, with the red shutters, I'm all for it. Really am. So let's go around and start putting in some other windows on these sides as well. So I need to remember the insides now because we kind of already got the floor plan down. Um, which sometimes is a bit annoying when you're putting... <laughs> floor plans into builds uh, or windows onto builds and then you look at the floor plans like oh that doesn't work that doesn't bloody work does it um, we can put them anywhere down here because we haven't done the floor plan downstairs yet um, which may prove a little bit difficult later on face is itching once again because I am recording you know how it goes you know how it goes in the Devon Bumpkin channel <laughs> okay um, more of these windows but I don't want to I, oh, I want three here Oh, that's perfect, actually. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. And the same here. Let's get up to this level. So we've got a cheeky room here. So I'm going to do two there. And then I'm going to do one there into the bathroom. Or do I want to do two? Does that look weird there? No, it doesn't really. Let's have a look. Oh, no, that's nice. That's nice. Do I want to take this roof right around the side? <laughs> Kind of bloody do. But the only problem is I'm going to have to. I can't put the roof I need around here because I would just normally use. I would do this. But look, it's just going to it's going to cause so much havoc on the inside. I won't even be able to. Why is it not going up there? There we go. If I pulled it through there, it's going to come into those bloody stairs, which is very annoying. Um... Maybe I could try a half-hipped. Let's have a look, see what we can make of this. If I can do the half-hipped to, like, say, there. Let's see. Let's see. I don't think this is going to work either. Let me just see. I'm going to pull you out there, darling. Let's get that. Oh, that's better. And then I might be able to match in this side here with another. Oh, God, look. See? You can't. You can't do it. Now, let's go back to what we had. And then I'll figure it out. I'll figure something out. Don't you worry. Don't you worry, my my sweets. I think what I need to do is get the floor plan downstairs figured out. So give me one second. And then I can place the windows where I need them to be then. So, got a little tiny weird shaped room. But this is, I'm going to make this into like a little snug. I'm going to make this into like a little snug with some books and stuff. I think that'd be a really nice place to have a read. Um, This is just going to be a hallway. Uh, with an entrance into a toilet here. Then there's going to obviously going to be an arch or a doorway into the main kitchen. This is going to be a pantry, dining room, and main living area on this side. I think that's going to flow quite nicely. I would have preferred this area to be bigger. Um, but I'm just going to work with what we've got. And it's going to flow okay. It will be fine. So we can now 
getting some more windows. Um, I'm thinking about doing... This looks a little bit weird having two windows there. I think it needs three on it. I think it needs three on these parts, like so. Um, right, so we've got the master bedroom now. I kind of want to do some bigger vibes on the master area, the master bedroom area. Do I want to do some shutters? I don't know. The only problem with that is, is the kitchen is below this and it would be difficult to put these windows below. So maybe sticking with these, but using the double ones instead um, would probably be the best way to do it. So if I can do them together, the same down in the kitchen area, um, like so. Lovely. Um, do I want to do these here or do I want to do like a a three moment on that side. I think we need to do three there as well. Three here. Let's get down so I can see what height we're doing these. There we go. Um, one, two, three. Stunning. Um, might do a door here. I might do a door there. So I'm just going to put a double door in there for the meantime. Um, and I'll probably use this one here for the minute. And then maybe change it up a bit later. I don't know. But that might be nice. Just so we've got entrance out because this is going to be decking out here. We're going to do a veranda all the way around, which would be nice. Yes. Okay. And then this was the dining room, wasn't it? So I might put these on the dining room as well. I'll do two there. Oh, I can do two there. Okay. Oh, that's a bit of a squeeze though. Let's have a look at that. Oh, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. These are so high. I don't like the height of those windows. I really don't, but I cannot bring them down because it just looks weird from the front. And I don't want it to look weird from the front. Oh, that's not too bad, actually. I can keep these up higher as well. I thought that was going to look really ugly, but that looks fine, doesn't it? Okay, we'll do that then. I'm going to figure out this roof as well because I kind of want this roof to go all the way around and wrap around the host side of this build now. Um... So I'm going to try and make that happen. I'm going to try and make that happen for us, my loves. Really am. Thank you to all of you guys as well that came to the stream on Friday. We played Phasmophobia, which is that like new ghost hunting horror. Me and a few friends and oh my God, it was absolutely hysterical. Absolutely hysterical. If you have missed that, just click down below on the, my Twitch link. You can go and watch it for free. It's up on Twitch. It's the last stream I've done. Um, You will piss yourselves because it was just so funny. It was so funny. Absolutely hilarious. Right. I need to like probably go off camera to do this roof piece because I'm going to get annoyed and I don't want you guys to see that. Yeah, it was easy as that, really. <laughs> I thought it was going to be a lot worse, but it wasn't. It was okay. I don't think it's creeping through anywhere either. No, it's not. Stunning. So I am going to... Do I want to use that full piece all the way around? I think I'll need another piece here as well. And pop you like... Uh, what? Oh, oh, it's because it's out of the lot. Right, we'll do it this way then, won't we? And I'm going to flop you to there. Um, Do I want to wrap it around that bit or should we end it there? Um, That's going to be weird ending it like that there. What about if I do it like there? That looks strange. Very, very weird. What about if I pulled it right in there and it wraps kind of a skirt around it? That's not too bad, actually. That isn't too bad. Um, what I used as well was um, a half-hip roof. I had to use the half-hip roof and then join it in with this side here, which um, kind of like just went to about there. You know? You yeah, know? And it kind of works. So let's get all of that on it. Let's, let me see this from the side. Oh, yeah, no, that'd be nice. That'd be really nice, especially... Um, I don't I hate that, actually, now. I wasn't feeling that, but that's not too bad. We're going to lift this house up quite high as well. Because we do want stairs and we do want a veranda going to it. So I'm going to lift it up to about... Maybe to there? Yeah, I think so. Oh, no. What, what the hell? Why did you come down for? Did they all do that? Why did they do that? Why? Maybe they need to be at default height. Because I did move them 90 miles away again. Sorry, my loves. Um, And you as well? Bloody hell, they're all at it. They're all bloody at it. 
Okay. Yeah. Obviously, we're going to do a lot more decorating, like details and stuff on the outside to make it kind of pop a little bit more. Um. Oh, God. Trying to pick a foundation for this is going to be difficult. Do I want to go black with it, maybe? Ooh, I kind of like that. What about you, though? You might fit it a bit better. Um, hmm. Hmm. It'd be nice if we could have some coloured ones like this, you know, when they've got like... Oh, the green looks quite nice, actually. I don't actually hate that. I mean, most of it's going to be hidden anyway. But I'm not really hating the green vibe of it. I think it's because it's complementing the red in it. I am kind of feeling that, my loves. I would love if this could go a bit higher, but it doesn't. It's that maximum height, which is a shame. But I will morph the shape of it slightly. Yeah, not too bad. Do you know what's really throwing me off? It's the size of these windows up here. I think these need to be smaller. Um, I'm going to go and find some better windows for up here. One sec. Actually, I think it's not so much the size of the windows. I think it was the amount of them. Just by putting one of the same window up there, it's made all the difference to me. It seems to have balanced itself a bit better. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Okay, cool. Right, veranda. We're going to do start putting in the decking now. How? What time are we up to here? Oh, not too bad. Not too bad. We can carry on for a bit longer. Right, you all the way around to there. Is that the right? Yes, it is. And then you all the way around to here as well, darling. We're going to get down to this level. Would be a lot easier, wouldn't it? I'm going to pull you to there and then I'm going to curve the back bit. I'm going to curve the back bit. Let's see where that roof line goes to. It goes to there. Can I come out one more here? Just for shits, tits and giggles, you know? Yeah, I think I'm going to. I think I'm going to. And then two there. And then I think I'll end with a curve on this side as well. So I'm going to just... What? Why was that getting rid of that then? I think I'm going to end with a curve there. Oh, stunning. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, No, I was going to put a curve there and there, but I'm not going to. Not going to do it. Not going to do it, my darlings. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is coming along. Coming along. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. Something needs to be up here, but I don't know what yet. We'll figure that out. Don't you worry. Right, some steps going up as well. Um, It's quite a stony kind of area, isn't it? I've never really used the Star Wars steps yet. Let me see what they look like. Um, eh, eh. <laughs> Maybe using these to get a bit of a terracotta moment going on here as well, just to bring a bit of their cultural influence into it. What, what would you look like? You seem to be... Oh! Oh, I don't mind that. I will make them a three-wide staircase as well. Oh, I quite like that. Do I? Or do we want to go blue, maybe? With a bit of blue in there. Mm, maybe not that. Let me have a think. I've chosen these steps here. I just thought they suit the vibe quite nicely. And then we're going to use this matching railing um, that came with Strangerville all the way around, I think. All the way around. Stunning. I'm just going to plonk them everywhere for the meantime because I do want to get a, a staircase coming down um, into the kind of little separate granny annex that we're going to do at the back. Don't know how we're going to do that just yet, but I've, I'm definitely still feeling it. I'm still feeling that vibe coming along. Really am. And we do the same for these up here as well. Um, they don't really have... I don't really like the Strangerville ones. I wanted more of a bit of drama. Was, is that the right red? It's not the right red. Can I use black? Ooh. Ooh, I might be able to bring a bit of black in. Let me see this. Ooh. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I kind of liked that one as well. It's just there's no detail in the middle of these ones. That's what bothers me. I prefer having detail coming down with, when using these. This has got the red and white kind of vibe. Oh, that's not too bad. Oh, that's not too bad. 
I think we'll go for this. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. Decorative, bright. Oh, does that look weird? Oh, God, that does look weird. I need to bring this in one. I think I got a bit excessive. I got a bit excessive with that decking. And then it gives us more room for the granny annex as well then. Um, yeah, let's get this all the way around. All the way around. Can you go there? Thank you. Uh, it, uh, it's like, what is the hot spot for some of these things? I never bloody know. Never know. Okay, and we're going to use the Strangerville um, pillars as well because I love them. Um, what one do we want to go for? Do we want this one or do we want this one here? Um, let me just see. Let me see this vibe. Eh, that's not too bad, but I think I'm going to use this one. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, I prefer that. Um, I'm going to maybe use quite a bit in the front. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, stunning. Absolutely stunning. Um, I'm going to put one... I don't want to do them all the way down here, I don't think. Or do I? Let's have a look. Is that a bit excessive? Oh, no, I kind of like it. I kind of like it. It's bringing in all these decorative moments, isn't it? And I'm full that. Can't place them on the curve because Sims. Um, So I'm just going to do this all the way. Oh, God, that's unbalanced there. Well, maybe I need to unbalance it back here then. So maybe I need to move you to the edge of the curve you there there we go and then one on the end there as well what flooring do we want the decking to be i don't know just yet i'm unsure just yet and are we going to put a gate around it i don't know i really just don't know um i think we need a trim as well what would you look like Ooh, no whoever designed that trim why did you do that why did you do that? Why did you do that to us? It's not very nice. It's not very nice at all. Right, I need to have a little play and see what trim we're going to be putting on. Give me one second. I ended up going for the red, like, high tide trim. I just think it looks quite nice. Um, and I've just wrapped it around everywhere. The more I'm looking at this, the more I do want to try a black trim with the house. Is this the right one that we're using? No, it's not. It's this one. Um... I'm thinking about trying a black trim with it. Oh, I kind of think I prefer it. Let's have a look. I don't know. Maybe using just the black trim on this part. And then the white trim on everything else. Because I do want to tie in those windows a little better. It'd be nice if these came in some good colours. Uh, what about if I try some red? Red trim. Oh. Oh, Jean-Claude. Oh. Oh, what about a mixture of white, red and white trims on these? Like red at the bottom, look. Oh, I like that. Yeah, we'll do that. And then, can I try red here? Let me see this. Oh. Oh, my loves. Oh, I think I prefer the red trim rather than the white so i'm going to use the red trim everywhere apart from on the bottom one i'm going to keep that one black or am i oh i don't know oh i'm gonna go i'm gonna do it red my loves i'm gonna go i'm gonna go crazy i am I'm gonna go absolute crazy and i think i'm going to no not you darling where's the square one there we go and i can put a little line there look stunning with that Oh, I like that. And the top bit as well. We need to do that. We need to remember to put that flat thing in there as well. I'll do that in just a sec. Oh, I like that. Yeah, the red trim's just really done something. And I'm for it. Right. Okay. So the top here, I do want to get a little moment in this rooftop. Let me see that. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. And then we're going to use that surface in here. And just flatten out this rooftop piece here. Just to hide a multitude of sins. Absolutely shush. No one has saw a thing. Um, I'm going to be live on Twitch tonight, my friends. As always, every Monday, 7pm. We're, we're building a uh, kind of haunted manor um, in The Sims 4. But I'm also going to be continuing 
The Maid of Scur, which is a horror game that we've been playing the last couple of weeks. So feel free to come along and join us, 7 p.m. BST. Um, yes, I do really want to get a fence up here, but maybe I should use the debug fence. I'll do that probably in the next part, though, because I haven't got my uh, mod on just yet. Um, but this is coming along, isn't it? It's definitely coming along. This area is going to be really cool once it's all done. Just looking at my other monitor as well, just to sort of see what it's looking like. Um... But this is not looking too bad. I do enjoy the way that this house is looking. Very nice indeed. But um, I think we'll crack on with this tomorrow. We'll crack on with more of the exterior work tomorrow. Um, Yeah, I think we'll leave it there for today. There we go, my darlings. Thank you so much for coming today. I really, really appreciate it. As always, I really want to hear from you guys in the in South America and Mexico. And I want to hear you guys and what you see in your family uh, houses um i want to i just want to be taught on your culture more really so please feel free to comment down below um on what i should be putting in the house and um yeah i want to hear from you i really do let's get this representation coming it's important but um but anyway i'm gonna leave you now i'm gonna be back tomorrow we're gonna be carrying on with this we'll carry on more of the exterior but yeah thank you for coming today my friends and i will see you tomorrow goodbye